excited now to welcome Nick Harrison, the Firewise Coordinator for Texas A&M Forest Service. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for the opportunity. Now, tell us why you're a liaison for the Ready, Set, Go program. Well, uh, we use that program across the state with all our, our public outreach and also with our uh, Texas A&M Forest Service has a long history of working with our cooperators, which are the fire service, whether it be volunteer, combination, or pay, and that's how we leverage all our programs. We actually are a fairly small agency, and so we've got to work with our partners to get the word out to the public. And tell me, what is the Ready, Set, Go program? Well, it's a, it's a, a, a pre-fire mitigation program that helps departments leverage with their homeowners and get them to look around their property. It uses information from the firewise communities. It uh, uh, allows them to be, look around their property and get it ready in case they impact a the wildfire. It gets them ready uh, in case they've got to evacuate. Most people don't think about that until it happens. And then it prepares them for when they leave. And so it's really all in one package helps them understand uh, what the threat of wildfire can do to their to impact. How do you implement this program within your work? Well, uh, I'm the statewide coordinator for FireWise and the Race That Go program. And we leverage that work through our staff across the state in uh, programs that we do with fire departments. We do a public outreach with homeowners associations, with almost anybody that will listen. And uh, it really came to the forefront in 2011 when we had a catastrophic fire season in Texas and got more and more people interested. When there's smoke in the air, people are interested. But also, if we can get this out to them and get people to read it, that really helps out. Share with me a success story of how the RSG has helped you or, or even one of the fire departments that you've worked well, there, with. I'll give you two instances. On, on, on literature we gave to a homeowner just north of Dallas here in uh, uh, Collin County. Uh, was coming home, saw a column of smoke, realized it was in his neighborhood. He got to thinking about, oh my gosh, this, that's coffee. As soon as he got further and closer and closer to home, he went, oh my goodness, that's in our neighborhood. And he remembered that he'd taken this information, he'd read it, he cleared out around his property, he moved uh, items off his deck, and uh, the fire was stopped before he got to him, but he realized he had little embers all around his property, and that he had done uh, the tenants that are listed in Ready, Set, Go. He'd done that, and he felt that that helped save his house. Wow. Then another instant, uh, uh, we were doing a NWCG training at a local fire department, also in Collin County, in Princeton, and the, a reporter was part of the class, and she took that information. Uh, uh, one of our staff gave a, a quick presentation on Ready, Set, Go as part of that training. She took a brochure, sent it to some friends of hers that lived in Colorado, and about the time the Black Forest Fire was happening, and they'd not seen that information, and they used that information to help evacuate from their home quickly. And so they felt that that helped them out. So those are success stories. And I, probably if you talk to any of the other estates or members, they have similar success stories. It's great validation for the work that you're oh, yeah, doing. Yeah. Keep spreading the word. Thank you so much, Thank Nick. you very much for the time and the opportunity.